Hello, I am giving an example of how to embed Spotify into your items on onto your pages, I guess. That's that's probably what should I should say. Um, first time I saw this was on an article I wrote for the Chimes Biola, and it was an article of a band that I went and wrote about. Got an interview with them and everything, it was great. Um, and I noticed that they put this Spotify thing up in the little right hand corner. Um, they did a Christmas album, so that's why that's there. But I'm going to show you how to do that um, on just a regular post on your WordPress or something like that. So, um, But we will be using WordPress to show you how to do that. So let me get to my regular page. That was an example of when I posted my article to my portfolio on my page. And then I just reposted the Spotify uh, Spotify link there as well. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to your posts. You're going to add a new one. Um, I mean, it doesn't have to be just on your post, I guess. You can do it on your page, too, if you want to just put music on your page. Uh, for whatever reason, I don't know, maybe you're a artist and you want to put your Spotify music on to uh, the front of your page for your examples, which would be good if you were an artist. So I'm just going to name this Spotify Embedded Music. Okay. Spelt that wrong because I didn't know how to spell it. There we go. And what we're going to do is I have this cool little link right here because it's already, Spotify's already downloaded onto my uh, computer. So open it up. Pick your music that you want to use it for. Um, let's just go ahead and reuse this one. And we'll click share. We'll copy the embedded code. It's really easy, it's really fast. And then we'll write a few things. Here's the assignment. I'm also doing this with one hand, so bear with me. And I spelled that wrong too. And let's just put an eye there. Anyway, and since it's copied already, there it is. There's my embedded code. Right there. We're gonna go ahead and don't forget to add it into a category because I do that sometimes and I forget to add it into a category. You know what? Just for the sake of uh, my posts, I don't want to have two the same thing on here, so I'm gonna go ahead and put uh, just grab an album out of here. Perfect, we'll put Citizens. That's good, wholesome Christian music. One song, literally just one song. There's that. Again, share, and you go over to the embedded part. I'm gonna go ahead and delete this old one right here. Done. Paste the new one, there it is. And I put it under my music page, um, or my music category, and then we'll just put citizens as a tag. Don't forget to add your tags and everything. All very helpful. And we're just going to put that one tag just because for the sake of the video. There's that. I'm publishing the page. Let's see if it worked. There it is. The whole album's there. I know I only had one album copied, but it just copies it straight from the um, the album of the user. So there it is. And then you can play the music too. And it usually plays through, it will play through your Spotify app. Um, it links your embedded code directly to the Spotify app. I think if you don't have it, um, it'll also allow you to listen to the music 
because you're just using Spotify to listen to music. And um, even if you don't have an account and you're looking at this for the first time and you don't have a Spotify account, I believe it still lets you use the music. Um, so yeah, that's how you add a Spotify uh, link, embedded link into there so you could listen to music on your page and have it for whatever you need it for. Um, thank you.